Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and this is the third part of this video on removing the white background. One of my viewers or subscribers was watching my video and said, why don't you just remove the white background when you trace it? Well, that's a good, that's a good way to do it, but there were so many whites, I didn't think it would work because of the fact that, well, I, I had actually had done it, but it didn't work. Um, when you trace this thing, Let's just go, it is, this this file is so large, it's got so many pixels, it's crashing my computer. And it's because I've got this other file, file probably open, but I'm going to trace bitmap. And I'm going to put high quality image, and I'm going to have to reduce it. And I've got right here, remove background, automatic to choose color, because there's so many colors in there. And I'm just going to show you that it is going to remove some of the colors. and hit OK. But basically there are only two colors. I'm going to press group objects by color and I'm going to give it some more detail at the same time. I think this is the key right here, group objects by color. And this is a large file. I think there's like 75,000 nodes. So it's been crashing my little laptop here. But I'm going to put OK. I'm going to get rid of this fly that's partially done. And I'm going to take my new file. And you can see it did exactly what the other one did. It didn't remove all the white. So go to object and ungroup object. And then because they're grouped together, the different whites click off your yellow and then click on a white object and you can see right down here it's G1 and then just hit delete and it deleted the all the other whites that we were having trouble getting rid of and then if my computer doesn't crash all the blacks are still grouped as you can see so we have to ungroup them if you're going to get rid of this person's name and it is a cool file sorry about that but anyway i hope that helped a little bit thank you for watching